how is everybody today? Today we are on the DAMT2 server. And do yeah, you remember the the jungle I was telling you about uh, last episode where I got all those uh, well got the, the saplings? So I'm I'm here again on the edge and spawns like way over there. Like so far over there it's not even funny. Yeah, uh, but we need more leaves, so I'm just gonna fill my inventory of leaves, and even then, I don't think we'll have enough. But it will be a start, right? <laughs> what? Hello? That was weird. Okay. Yep, so we'll just, uh, we'll de-shrub the jungle. I just got some grass there. We'll do that too. <laughs> we'll we'll uh, mow the, the jungle. And it'll look healthy. Might as well grab the stumps so it doesn't look so weird. Oh, that's more grass. I'm just gonna, you know, put them back where they belong. There we go. <laughs> now, you don't need to watch me uh, de shrub this area. So, I will cut back to footage when I'm all done. Okay? I'll see you in a moment. So I'm on my way back. I didn't get very far, as you can tell. And I see that cave, and there's a sign inside of it. I wonder what the sign says. Never trust ghost with a plane? What? That's like the most random sign I have ever come across. What? Okay. I mean, it's true. Never, never trust him, because he always crashes them. But why is that sign all the way out here? I don't... I, I just don't understand. That's... <laughs> I'm... I went into the cave hoping that there was information on why that sign was here, but it doesn't appear that there is. Hi, right, Mr. Creeper. Oh. Oh, fine. I was nowhere near you. You didn't have to do that. Is that where we came from? No. So it's official. Her dad lost. Unless we're closer to go one of Ghost's places. I don't see a hidden place anywhere. Huh. I don't know. Which... Okay, so I just came from that direction, I assume. Now let's see if I can get to the top. I don't think I can. That was the most random sign. Never trust ghost with a plane. I wonder who wrote that. I don't think it was me. I would have remembered, I would think. Okay. Oh. Just takes us on through to the other side. 
I I really saw this. I was I was intrigued by that. Looks like it, it's just a random stone pillar. Huh. Now the question is... Where the heck was that sign? Was it down here? No. Did we just imagine it? What? Oh, there it is. Okay. Huh. I, I, I guess I'll, I'll just go home now and we'll start our, our, uh, build for the episode. Huh. But first I want to find some, um, some clay. And if I could find some clay, that would be great. Got plenty of room for it. I want to make some cement. And if I remember correctly, you need clay and gravel, I think. And I'm gonna be straight with you. I don't think I'm heading the correct direction. But we'll find out. Eventually. So, I guess the question is, what are we going to do today? Well, it's simple, really. We're going to find, uh, oh, might as well put those in there with that. They're going to be on the same project, might as well. And this, okay, let's figure out how to make, uh, I don't know, concrete? Concrete. Uh, yeah, gravel and sand. And I just got the clay for no reason. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> gravel and sand. I need. Well, okay, okay. Uh, I guess I could put that away then. No sense in having it right now. Put those away. I'm just gonna throw everything in here for now. This is gonna be the, the catch-all chest. And eventually I'll clean it out. Um, yeah, we can store that in there. Guess we could store that in there too. And... Yeah, fair enough. Okay, so I need gravel and I need sand. I don't have a whole lot of sand, it doesn't look like. Could have swore I did, but apparently not. Maybe not in that chest. And then I need some gravel. I'm going to assume that's good, and then I want... Oh, I don't know. Red dye. What can I use as red dye? Uh, there's beetroot. Do I have any beets? Not down here. Okay. In that case, I need to find a rose. Yeah, I got one in here? No. Okay, I'll go upstairs. Because I think I've got some down there. Or up there. And let's see here. Where is it? Haha. -ha. And you know what? Oh. I want that. And I want all of uh these. I'm gonna turn those into bone meal. And we're gonna go to sleep again. Well, I, I don't know if I've done it on on camera, but I've slept a couple times. That bed is laying right on me. That's gotta be heavy. Okay, so I don't know if you guys were aware, but if you place 
two high flower down like that and you spam it with bone meal you get more <laughs> so I'm just gonna use all of the bone meal there we go and I'll pick those up break that and we want to keep at least one so we can do that again looks like we got one Oh, it worked out. Okay. And I just got a lot of red. Huh. The election should be coming up soon. Uh, yeah. There we go. And then that. Red. No, 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 no. Want the concrete powder? Where is it? Where'd it go? Uh, let's see here. We'll just drop that in there and we'll go. Come on, get to the red. Get to the red. Brown, blue, black, red. There we go. So, I guess we can just go like that, right? And like that. like that and then do the same with the gravel we're gonna have so much of this stuff I think it's gonna be overkill that's all right and we'll just do that voila and we'll go stick the the uh, stuff and the dye back in here in our dye chest. Put that there. Now comes the fun part. I uh, gotta figure out a way. I think I know of a way to make all of this into actual concrete. other than just placing it all there. Shut up! Yeah, that's gonna take a long time. I'm gonna figure this out. I'll be right back. Okay, so here's my theory. If I have a really long and tall uh, water tower and I just do something like this should work all the way up, right? And I'm correct. Uh, I, th I think this is almost two stacks tall. You know, like short two, maybe. So, yeah, it, it's it's gonna work. It's it's a little more efficient than you know, placing the block, waiting for it to solidify, destroying it, placing the block. Instead, you can just do it all in one go. This is the first one. Yeah, I already tried it. <laughs> uh, I just wanted to make sure that I wasn't going to look stupid. Uh, which happens quite a bit. So I don't know why I should be embarrassed by it. But, yeah, whatever. Uh, I figure... Might as, might as well look intelligent in some videos. And two blocks left over. Two blocks left over. And we can just ride the the uh, the blocks down. It's 
not an insta mine, but it's it's good enough. I think I've got like efficiency five or four on this pick. I'm not too sure. Haven't looked at it in a while, but it's getting the job done. Eventually. And lucky for us, uh, this is this is pretty easy to make. I wonder what would have happened if I actually used the concrete powder to tower up. And then I said, I think that would have worked a little better. Yeah, I. I we have had a missed opportunity, guys. Okay. We're gonna have like four left up. Which ain't all that bad. So I'll be right back. Okay, now to the actual building part. And I think I'm running low on time, so I probably won't be, uh work in here too long and we might have to save it for next week but at least I can show you the proof of concept so I figure since we have a bridge here and we're gonna have a bridge uh, connecting us from over there we might as well have a city here right So, I'm gonna build a really nice looking desert city uh, and maybe tie it in with uh, the, the village over there. And then we'll, uh, we'll have a reason for coming over here instead of just going across the, the ocean like we usually do. And I think the theme is going to be fire. Well, not really fire, you know, red, basically. I was thinking maybe purple might go good in the desert, which I think it might. However, I think red will go better. Got an idea for uh, religious buildings, uh, more more uh, houses, things like that. There we go. And first I gotta kinda level it out the best I can. I'm, I'm not gonna level all of it out because terrain is good. However, terrain is also hard to work on. So the cleaner it is, the easier it is to build. That's why I decided this old block would be on a super flat world when it first began almost two and a half years ago. I, I figured it would be the easiest terrain to build on, but it gets boring, so it's, it's not going to be all flat all the time. Okay, so this... I, I, I don't know if I'm going to keep it. Uh, I, I'm, if I do, I'm definitely going to move it over uh, one this way, but, you know, maybe two this way, because it's off-center. And... Uh, it, it looks weird right now, but I'm going to fill the inside of this, you know, at least the, the border of this area. You know, with gold blocks and then uh, I'm gonna fill in this area with uh, sandstone and maybe put fountains on either side uh, and then it's gonna go into the city and Obviously, we're going to put some lights in there. 
Uh, that way, this doesn't happen again. But, what, what do you guys think? I don't know if I like it. Uh, if you have any questions, statements, concerns, feel free to leave them in the comments below. I will get back to you. Um, let me know what you think of this. Uh, if you like the video, go ahead and leave a like down below. And, I mean, you might as well hit that subscribe button while you're at it, too. It really helps me out. Uh, and while you're at it, you might as well subscribe to everybody else in We Crazy Few. Uh, we really appreciate it. We really support. Er, we really enjoy your support. I don't know how uh, how many more times I can repeat myself. <laughs> um, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye bye.